Welcome to the Get Started with Amplify Central video series. In a previous video, we showed you how to register an API as an API proxy. In this video, you'll learn how to secure an API using an API key as an example. You'll also learn how to manage access to an API using an app and how to deploy and test the secured API. Now let's get started in Amplify Central. On the API Proxies page, you can see all of the API proxies that you've already registered. Today, we're going to be working with the Star Wars API, which is owned by the default team. Let's take a look. To see where it's currently deployed, click the Deployments tab. It's deployed on the test runtime. To see the current policies applied to the API, click Policies. The client authentication is currently set to pass through. To secure the API, let's change the client authentication policy. Let's secure it with an API key as an example. Choose API key as the authentication type and save. This creates a new revision of the proxy. Let's deploy the new revision to the test runtime. Now, because we've secured the API with an API key, to test it, we need to create an API key. You create this key by creating an app. Let's go to Apps. On the Apps page, you can see all of the apps that you've created already. Apps are used in Amplify Central to represent the client applications that are going to consume your API. You use apps to manage access to your API and to create and store credentials, such as API keys. To identify the client applications consuming your API separately, you can create multiple apps, each with a different API key. Let's create a new app for the Star Wars API. Enter a name and select a team. The team you select here must have access to the Star Wars API, so we'll select the default team. Now we'll add authentication and APIs to the new app. First, let's add an API key. Next, you need to select the APIs that this app can access. Let's add the Star Wars API. Now, let's return to the Star Wars API. To test the API, Select the runtime where the API is deployed and select the API key from the Star Wars app. Let's try the API to get all the Star Wars films. As you can see, the API was executed successfully and here in the response are all the Star Wars films. Now you know how to add an API key authentication policy to your API, how to create an app to manage access to your API, and how to deploy and test your secured API in Amplify Central. If you want to learn more about Amplify Central, visit the Axway Doc portal at docs.axway.com or go to the Axway YouTube channel for more videos. Thank you for watching.